All right, you ready, kitty cat? Yeah. Okay, we're gonna go live now, my love. I'm just, I'm just gonna go into the interview. Woo! Okay, hang on. I know, I know. I have to move it. I have to move it. Hang on a second. Wait. As usual, I'm screwing it up. Okay, hang on, hang on, on. There we go. There she is. There she is. There's my girl. <laughs> We're live. <laughs> we are live. Hi, guys. Am I? I'm just. I hope you're in this. I hope. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Every time I do this, kitty cat Nini, I screw it up. Wait, just let me check how you look. Uh. Oh. Sensi Bellina said, that's my girl, not yours. Oh, oh, okay. All right. Um, okay. Does the, does she look good? Have I positioned her on screen correctly? Because I'm scared to move a damn thing, y'all. Hang on. Wait. Oh, oh, oh. There we go. There we go. She looks good. Um, you guys. Hi. Um, I am so excited because I am here with, um, oof, that is really loud. Sensi Balina just followed. I apologize if I said your name incorrectly. Thank you so much for following. Guys, I'm really excited because today I am, I am doing an interview with the one, the only Kitty Cat Nini. Kitty Cat Nini is a girl gamer all the way in Portugal. I am Miranda O'Hare. If you don't know me, I am the voice of Sky in the video game Valorant. Um, and I have a little series on my Twitch channel where I interview girl gamers. Um, so, okay. Um, so, oh, we have another follow follower, Horoska followed. Thank you so much for following. Um, and I was put in contact with this beautiful girl, Kitty Cat Nini. Um, who I'm just going to call, what should I call you, Mama? Should I call you Kitty Cat? You can, uh, like, my my community. Uh, um. They call you Nini or they call you Kitty Cat? Yeah, Nini. 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 Oh, okay, okay, I'll call, yeah. I'll call you Nini. Okay, um, so my girl Nini and I were put in uh, contact because of our mutual friend, uh, Zaki, from the YouTube channel Valorant Hub. So uh, that is... Uh, really cool. I'm very glad to have been connected with her. And I will tell you as well that uh, you actually were mentioned to me before Zaki brought you up about interviewing you. You were mentioned to me a few times as a, uh, a girl gamer that I should reach out to. So you've been on my on my radar for a minute. Um, so I'm really excited to do this interview today. Um, we're not going to be able to acknowledge the chat as much as we might in a normal stream because I'm going to be interviewing, um, Nini. So I just want to make sure that I'm giving her my full attention, but I will respond to you guys, um, as often as I can in chat. And so, and so will Nini. Um, so yeah, guys, I will say, uh, f sh she's a little nervous to do this interview because <laughs> we have to remember English is like her second language. It is so, uh, so incredible to me that you are coming on here talking to me in a language that isn't even your first language. Like I have all the respect in the world for you. Um, so just know that I'm here for you. Don't worry about anything. It's just you and me and a couple of our mates just talking. Okay. 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 <laughs> <laughs> all right. So first of all, kitty cat, tell me about you. Tell me, tell me some things about you so I can get to know you better. Well, uh, Let's start, like, uh, thank you so much for your, your invitation uh, for your stream. I'm really happy. Like, it's really a dream come true. Aww. So, <laughs> so um, I'm, I'm a girl from a little, a little a small village, you know, so I'm not a city girl or anything. Um, so it's been a, a bit difficult since the beginning, like uh, being um, a gamer or like online gaming, you know, so 
it was really late that I started to play online. Okay. Uh, but I I played uh, games like all my life with my father. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> you played video games with your dad? Yeah, like uh, we we got um, Nintendo. Uh huh. Like the the whole the really old one, and he he teach me how to play Mario. Oh Super yes, Mario. Yeah. yes, yes, iconic. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, is your dad so proud of you? Oh, like my 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 parents don't 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 know like all of this. They know what I do, but they don't understand it. Same with my parents. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> they don't get it at all. I try to explain what Twitch is to my mom and she doesn't get it. I don't even think that they understand like being the voice of a video game character. They're like, okay. I'm like, no, it's a big deal. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, like I was, I was like talking with my mom. Like, I uh, today I have an interview with like, um, with someone that I I think is really special, and like she she's the voice for a character that I like, and she was like, mm, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Oh my god. It's like they don't get it at all. It's so funny, um, but that's okay. We get it. So. That's what matters. <laughs> um, so you played uh, video games with your dad, and then how did you end up playing Valorant? Like, how did that happen? So I started uh, being a Fortnite streamer, uh, and like how I was getting good at it. Um, uh, I was like trying to compete with other girls, like doing like. A team or stuff and like eventually uh, Valorant came out and I was not enjoying Fortnite anymore <laughs> and it was like uh, I knew like from the beta like I played the beta mm -hmm. so I knew right away that was my game and why why were you not enjoying uh, Fortnite well, uh, I really had a, gr a great time with Fortnite at the, the, at that time. Uh -huh. um, I played it for a long time. Um, Sorry, hang on. Sorry, <laughs> I accidentally played the, the stream on my thing. So go on, yes, yes. Yeah, I played for so long and I was like getting a little dismotivated, I think. Uh, it's how you say it. Uh, -huh. uh it was it was like I I needed a new game. Yeah, okay, okay. I don't know much about Fortnite. What's Fortnite? Like what's the I mean, I know I've heard of it, but I don't know wh what happens when you play it. Is it the same as Valorant like you main a person and then you like, you know, fight for something? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's really different. Oh, uh, it is. Okay. Uh, Valorant was like uh, my first impression on, on that type of game. Fortnite is really different. You uh, you know Hunger Games is like Hunger Games. You put like yourself on um a sta a, uh, in a space that you have like a hundred people and you have to kill all of them oh. and stay alive at the end. Oh my god, <laughs> that's crazy. Ah. Uh I think the unique thing about Valorant, and obviously I'm biased, but uh, I think the unique thing about Valorant is that they put so much effort into creating characters that are representative of all uh, communities and, and um, nationalities and stuff, right? And then they yeah. also put so much effort into uh, telling a story on a, on, a, on a big scale and having that story... Uh, continue on right like there's a narrative and then it keeps going like I think the lore of Valorant is what makes it very special and really unique um, to other video games um, because I think that that's something that the video game community really wants you know yeah that, that was one thing that uh, he, like it cut, it cut me like right away like um, I really like uh, the work of Robasa too like the raised boys okay mm -hmm. so 
so uh, your character was not right on the game for for like on beta and Ravasa had uh, her character from the beginning oh carolina sorry yes i know yeah. who you're talking about yes sorry sorry i was like a little yeah. confused yes yes i know who you're talking about mm-hmm. and uh i played the little of overwatch and i know right away the voice it was from sombra and i got really <laughs> excited and i really liked uh, the the voiceover mm. In like the the way that um, the characters have their own personality is really like catching. Is the that that's that was the thing that catch me. Yeah, yeah. It's funny because I remember uh, when I auditioned for uh, for the voice of Sky. I think that. I remember getting the brief for the character and feeling that I knew her because I have some similarities in terms of my life experiences to hers. Like I, I'm from a country town, like, so I know how people from country towns with an Australian accent speak. And so I, we just had things that I related to, to her on, you know, I'm very obsessed with animals and stuff. I'm also very bad at technology. No, like oh, you've learned that. <laughs> already today you've seen how bad I am with technology I don't know if Sky's bad with technology but that's not what she leads with you know and so I kind of just thought like I connected with her a, a little bit and I remember putting down the audition and my manager kind of had suggested that maybe like it wasn't exactly technically perfect if that makes sense like I could have redone it to make it more technically perfect Thank you so much, KJ222 official for following. Also, someone hosted us a couple of minutes ago and I didn't acknowledge that and I'm sorry about that. But thank you so much for hosting us as well. Um, and my manager had said, you know, you could redo it uh, so that it was more technically proficient. But I think what was more important to me was that I had captured what I think is a character. And I think that that's what like you look at like, Ali, who's the voice of Phoenix and stuff, the character of Yuru and the character of Phoenix are so clear to me. Like, you know exactly who those people are, you know their personalities, and uh, I just think that that's really crazy because it's like, you're kind of like watching an animation series, but you can also play the characters. It's crazy. Yeah. Yeah. Egg's Pony is also following. <laughs> Um, okay, so I know how you got into, uh, to, uh, playing Valorant. Um, do you do Twitch full time? Um, well, I'm trying to. Uh-huh. Uh, all of these started, uh, from nowhere. Like, I was not planning doing it all, like, full time. But, like, the pandemic and stuff, and I couldn't, um, work, uh, I couldn't work. Okay. So, like I, uh, I, I got my my degree like uh, on. Nine, uh, I don't know how you say it. online. Oh, online on the internet. No, no. Like when when year after the the pandemic, like I got you, you graduated. Like, a degree. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And I couldn't find any job because of that. So. I was starting the the streaming thing, and and the guys from my chat they are amazing and got me into it. Oh, that's awesome! Um, and so okay, so what was your degree in? What did you do at college? Oh, I I'm a graphic designer. Oh wow, that is such a uh, such a great skill to have in this, in, in any kind of social media, like, community. I think not, I guess Twitch is social media. I don't know if it is or not. Yeah, I guess. Yeah. Um, it's such a great skill to have. That's such a useful thing to have. Yeah, it is. It's really, yeah, I, I noticed that. It yeah. It's really easy to start. Yeah, you probably have such an understanding for tech and how it all works. Like, it probably comes quite easily to you. Oh, I'm, I'm not the greatest at tech, but I try. <laughs> I, see, I see some tutorials on YouTube and stuff. Oh, good. Yeah, no, that's awesome. Do you, um, so like, do you hope to do Twitch full time? Like if I was to say to you, like, 
what's your like five year plan? Like, do you have a five year plan in terms of like what you hope to achieve or? Well, like now I'm doing it full time. I I hope I could like deliver from it, but it's really hard. Like in Portugal, the community is really small, mm. and I know that it's really hard to just stream for a living mm -hmm. here. Mm -hmm. But like I I think I can do it at the both things like doing graphic design and uh, stream at the same time. Yeah, if, it, mm -hmm. if I have to. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I love that idea. Um, you could maybe like freelance and then yeah. also stream until you begin streaming full time. And so something really cool about you that I don't know if the community knows um, if they're not like your fans <clears throat> um, initially is that you are the ambassador of Killjoy um, in Portugal. How did that happen? Tell me about that. Yeah, that was a crazy ride. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, like uh, when the the game um, came out, mm -hmm. uh, Killjoy wasn't a a character, and I was meaning other character. Okay. Mm -hmm. When she came out, I was like, that that is really my me, you know. Like I immediately uh, thought that she was so cool, and. <laughs> the personality is really similar and stuff. Really? Um, Why do you feel like the the personality is similar? Uh, I don't know. She's really nerdy, and I really <laughs> like. I think she's so cute. I can. <laughs> um. Okay. I love that. I love that. That's a great answer. And, well, in yeah, and like when when she came out. Uh, like all my friends said that I was really a uh, lookalike her, and yes. I was like, "Yeah, that's crazy." And she came out on my birthday. Oh my god! Yes, you're meant to main this girl. Damn. And she was she was crazy. And like some somebody said to me to make the cosplay. Oh. And the the Valorant Portugal a note. I that and they made me the the offer that I had to make the cosplay to become the ambassador and it was like okay I try it oh my god wait so so when you got to be so what does being the ambassador for Killjoy mean like what what kind of responsibilities do you have oh it was a lot <laughs> really wow yeah like you uh I'm the face of Killjoy in Portugal. Like, every, everyone knows about Nini Joy. Like, the chat is just like talking about that. Oh my god. <laughs> this is amazing. Okay, okay. So, you you have to talk about Killjoy. Like, and, and who made you the ambassador? Was it Riot that made you the ambassador? Yeah, like Riot Portugal, the Valorant team from Portugal um, uh, make me the offer to be the ambassador. Oh, I wow. Said yes. <laughs> like I uh, like they they told me to teach other persons to to play with her. Oh, so they've set up like a lot of collaborations for you. Oh, I don't I don't know. Like, um, I, I just they the, have they the have they oh you teach people how to play Killjoy. Yeah. Oh wow! Like uh, they made they made like a video on YouTube that it's me like teaching. Okay. Okay. One day when I play Valorant, I'll have to play with you, and you'll have to be my teacher. <laughs> well, I don't know how to play Sky. <laughs> I guess I should probably sp play Spy Sky if I ever play Valorant. But I could I could play Killjoy just for to give it a shot. <laughs> she um so okay what tell me so you you feel like you look like her she came out on her, your birthday um had what is what is your favorite uh voice line from killjoy oh <laughs> i have so many voice lines that i really like yeah she's really quirky and nerdy and cool uh, i don't know like he has one that is like 
good one step closer to be back on pajamas <laughs> and i really like it I, what, so one, what is it one step closer to what to be back on pajamas to, oh to be back in pajamas yeah okay okay um i'll have to uh i'll have to try to do uh, so i have a tiktok and on, on my tiktok i've done impersonations of a couple of the other characters so I did Carolina because I think she did Sky. I, I think Carolina did Sky. So then I do edit her and I think I did uh, Raze. I can't remember. Anyway, but I'll do, um, I'll have to do uh, Killjoy for you. Are you on TikTok? Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you won't see it. Well, I'll message it to you. I'll send it to you. Okay. okay. You should get okay. on, you should get on TikTok, dude. Uh, maybe. Yes, you could go. Like he did the same thing. Oh, I know. He told me. I was like, I can only imagine because he's like, he's like, I feel like he's my agent sometimes because <laughs> he's like, he's like, you got to do this and you got to do this. And I'm like, okay. Like he was telling me that when you guys were talking that you were like taking it all in. And I'm thinking like, yeah, that's what I do. He needs to be like a, an agent for gamers. Don't you think? Like a t yeah. like a talent manager for gamers? Like I think he'd be really yeah. good at that. He's really good at doing that. Like when we uh, when we did the interview, mm -hmm. um, he talked to me uh, like three or four more hours after that. He's so nice. He's so yeah, nice. Yeah, he's so nice. He like, yeah. He helps. He helps me a lot. Like I wouldn't like seriously even understand half the stuff I understand if it wasn't for Zaki because he explains so much stuff to me. I think um, I fe I feel like yeah, you should take advantage of the fact that you are the ambassador for Killjoy. Like that's such a big deal, especially because you're right. Like you look like her. Like I didn't even <laughs> think about that. I'm such a silly head. Like. You should go, you should like start a TikTok and put that in your bio and then you can start making like, all you have to do really is uh, share your gameplay because a lot of people just love watching gameplay on TikTok. Yeah, I have to do it. You should definitely, definitely do it. And I can like, I'll like duet you or anything like that just to, you know, make sure people see it. That's so cool. Um, okay, I've got my questions over here. I always um, like asking people this because I think it's a really interesting question. Okay, so tell me what a normal day in your life is like. What time do you get up? Like, what time do you go to bed? Do you drink a glass of wine? Do you have hot chocolates? Like, tell me about you. Well, uh, my day is really full when, like, a normal day of streaming. Mm-hmm. Uh, I, I wake up really early to go to the gym. Oh, okay. Okay, love that. <laughs> yeah, and like, um, I, I don't go in the public gym. I have like a friend that has like the, um, the stuff on the, uh, her own and I, I'm used to go there. Okay. Yeah, so it's like girl time. <laughs> yeah, oh, that's so cute. I love that. Okay, yes. <laughs> yeah. And we we are not allowed to talk about boys there. <laughs> Is that your rule? Yeah. Oh my god, love that. <laughs> no boy talk. Okay. Mm -hmm. No. Then I go I go home and I do my 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 food to lunch. Okay. I make like the adjustments to start streaming and I start streaming like 2 p.m., 3 p.m. Mm -hmm. And I go like till evening. <laughs> so what time would you stop streaming? Uh, a little, a little before dinner, like 30 minutes before dinner. Okay. And after dinner, I, I make some clips. Uh, make some adjustments for the stream for the other day. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, all you need to do is take those clips and put them and put them on TikTok. Yeah. <laughs> I have. <laughs> I'm like, start a TikTok. <laughs> <laughs> um, oh, okay. Oh, 
Okami Caddy is now following. Also, um, Char Sylvia followed it earlier, and I didn't acknowledge that. So thanks so much for following, guys. I really appreciate it. Guys, if you're not following already, um, follow Kitty Cat Nini on Twitch. Um, she is a fantastic girl gamer, and we'd love to see it. Um, also, follow me on Twitch if you want as well. We have Ahari Gamer Techie is now following too. This is fantastic news. Uh, follow me on my socials as well. Um, I do TikTok, Instagram, the whole thing, but I'm really quite active on TikTok, which is obviously why I'm trying to get you to do TikTok as well, Kitty Cat Nini. Um, okay, so I know that you love the lore of Valorant. So what is yeah. what is your favorite part? Like what's do you have like a like a little like what is your favorite thing about the lore? Do you have like a conspiracy theory? Like tell me. Yeah, I, I talk about that with Zeki all the time. We love to uh, to make conspiracies and stuff. Oh my god, tell me what they are. Like um we analyze the maps and and try to understand the lore because one of my favorite things about the lore is that it's not written and and anywhere so you have to figure it out and it's really fun to like and mysterious i love it oh okay so what but do you have like a little conspiracy theory like do you have something that you like think like that certain people are are like room like everyone always says that who do they say that breach has got a thing with is it my character or is it someone else <laughs> i don't know but like i know that uh brim is like a father for a killjoy oh that's so and... cute <laughs> yeah and like uh um i really like the part that viper uh at I think he made something to woman and in, in like he's a monster now because she failed. Wait, what? Say that again. Like a uh, viper was like a doctor and I think she made like a thing to woman and he became a monster because of her. She failed the 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 thing. <laughs> Oh, no. like a like a an experiment gone wrong type yeah. situation. Yeah. Interesting. What do you think of Cipher? Oh, Cipher is such um like he has a, such a similar vibe like Killjoy, you know, like he's quirky and funny and cute. And I love one one voice line that he has with Killjoy that is like uh, Cypher, do you show me the dark web one of, of these days? And it's it, it all like, no, we ha we must protect you. Like, it's, yeah, it's oh, like interaction. yes, yes, yes. Um, which one is the one that's, uh, Cypher is the one that's kind of like, ooh, like he has the deep, really deep voice. Wait, I'm uh, No, no, he's Omen. Omen! Omen's the one that's like so crazy to me. What's what's your theory? Yeah. What's your theory on Omen? I'm gonna check it's Omen that I'm thinking of. It is like is what I told you, like Viper made a failed experiment oh. and he became a monster. <gasps> okay, I get that more now. Sorry, I wasn't listening properly. Oh my god, okay, okay, that's a good theory, yeah, because I'm like, what? Have you seen the guy do the voice of Omen? Yeah, it's crazy. I really like all the voice overs, you know, like I I I I know a lot of the voices. The yeah. Voices line. yeah. What's yeah. what's a he talks like he goes like um I can't even do it! Wait Yeah, yeah it's really it's really amazing. I don't know. And you Viper has that thing too, like is a really deep voice and like uh, a crazy voice. I don't know. So, okay, okay, and who's the VA for Killjoy? I don't even know who the VA for, for Killjoy is. Is it Eva? Uh, I don't know who it is, but I think is she's not, like, um, really crazy about it. I think she got really, uh, like, a lot of backlash because of the, the German accent, and I think she's not, like, 
going to be public. Yeah, I think I think I know who yeah. it is. Yeah. Um yeah, I mean, do you know what though? I got so much backlash. Everyone hated me. And I was getting I don't know why I love your voice lines. <laughs> I was like, getting it's... fucking shat on. I was getting like press articles written about me saying that like I was pretending to be Australian and like people were writing like the craziest stuff about me online. And then I was people are, are really are really bad when they when they really want. Mm-hmm. And I was getting like people saying I mean people still say uh uh, like, you know, kind of crazy stuff to me about, about, um, Skye, like how they really hate her as a character and stuff. People say a lot of stuff to me. Um, they integrate with your own today. That's really crazy. Yeah. And it's, it's hard to like, not, I completely understand if that's the reason why she decided to not do it, because it's very hurtful to have people say that, like, especially when you're like, you know, it's a video game character, so it's, like, their voice is going to be, like, different. You know what I mean? Like, they're gonna, they're, it's their, their voice is going to be a little bit more exaggerated because it's it's a video yeah. game character. It's the same as an animation voice. Hey, it's not a... It's, like, a thing. People just, like, get really mad, though stupid thing yeah i know people need to chill out a little bit but yeah a lot lot of people came for me a lot online so i do understand if that's her if that's her position on it because sometimes it's hard to like let that go and move past it um okay so do you have a theory specifically about killjoy other than the wait go tell me well i think killjoy made all the maps and all the things I don't know. Ooh. She's really smart, and I think she made all of it. And like the tech is against her now. Mhm, mhm. Um, what do I say? I say, uh, what's so special about Killjoy's tech? I've got visual senses too. They're called eyes. Have you heard that <laughs> line? Yeah. <laughs> I just remembered that when you said the tech thing. I was like, oh, yeah, I say that. (laughs) I don't think Sky likes Killjoy that much. Yeah, I don't think so. (laughs) I don't get why. It's really weird. Yeah, they they don't have um, much interaction. Yeah, yeah. I think they're just probably very different kind of people. Yeah, but I think they have uh, some stuff that is, like, equal, like... Killjoy has her pets too, but they are machines, like mm-hmm. uh, a machine, uh, what, like the turret, uh, the Killjoy turret is like a bird, Yeah, uh, it's like a chicken, and uh, like all the, the, the robots are like an animal, and it's really similar, I don't know why they don't connect that much. Yeah, that's funny, As someone commented, her. Hirokusa, I'm sorry if I said that incorrectly, said Killjoy is futuristic. And uh, Databoy Gaming, hi Databoy Gaming, uh, said Sky loves nature while Killjoy embraces tech. And I think that that's that's true. Yeah, but they are really different, but really similar at the same time. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, no, I totally know what you're saying. What do you feel about Yuru? Oh, Yoru is such a cool um, character. Yeah, yeah. Like, he is like the cool kid on class. <laughs> yeah. I know, he's like a bad boy, huh? Yeah. <laughs> he's probably like a ladies' man. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I-, I think Phoenix is too, like, they are really similar. Yeah, except Phoenix is a bit more of a, like, he's a bit more of a joke star, you know? Yeah. Phoenix, yeah. Phoenix is is my favorite. I really like Phoenix. He's his his voice actor is so cool. He's so iconic. Um, yeah. I I feel the 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 voice actor is really like Phoenix. I don't know why. They really I know. Like I feel Phoenix. that too. I feel that too. I I really want to get him on, but I want to wait until I'm a little bit more. Like, I've, I'm more used to interviewing and stuff because I think I would be interested to... Uh, sorry, I would be nervous to interview him. Um, and I just... 
<laughs> like, I don't know why it's so stupid that I would be nervous. Like, I wouldn't be nervous to, to interview any of the other voiceover actors, but I just... Then you understand me, right? <laughs> like, I'm in here. Because I would be, like, fangirling. Even though I've spoken to him a little bit online, I would be, like, fangirling a little bit, so... Yeah. Um, but, yeah, I... <laughs> you right now. <laughs> Oh my god, don't even. <laughs> um, so I want to ask you about, like, so obviously, uh, you know, you're a girl, you're a girl gamer, that's why I have you on here, um, and I want to say, like, what, what do you think, like, like, how do you handle, do you, have you experienced any negativity online from being a girl playing games? Oh yeah, of course. <laughs> And how do you like, deal with it? That's a, a really a bad reality. Like, um, I think every girl, uh, oh, sometime had it. Hang right? on, hang on, two seconds. So Ryan seems to to be changing usernames. Ryan loves Miranda. Ryan is a simp for Miranda. Thank you, Ryan. I don't know who you are. But <laughs> these usernames are really. <laughs> <laughs> really quite intense. Um, God, uh, God bless you. Thanks for following along. I appreciate you. Um, sorry, my love. Continue on. Uh, um, I think every girl uh, felt that. Like, um, a little bit of mashes. How do you say that in English? I don't know. Uh, wait, what was the word? What did you say? D you say feminist and you say mashes? I don't know. Oh, misogyny? Misogyny? No, 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 no. Like, uh, when um, a boy is like, you, your place is, on, is in the kitchen, is meshes, right? I don't know. I don't know, but I understand. <laughs> no, I understand what you're saying. Okay, yes, yes. Okay, okay, yes. It's meshes. I think oh, okay. it's meshes. Maybe I just don't know the word. Yes, go on. Perfect. Okay. Yes. So, like, um... I I always try to just play, you know? Like, I'm there to play, not to do friends. Like, I wish I, I, I was there to make friends, but, like, with so much of that, I'm there to play. If I make friends, is like, one good thing. But at the, <laughs> at the end, I'm just there to play and to rank up. Yes! So yes! I just play. You've got that. Uh, you've got that like boss energy. You've got that like boss bitch energy. You're like, this is, I'm just here to run shit. <laughs> I'm not here to make friends, you guys. I'm just here to run shit. I'm like, I love that view. That's cool. Oh my God. Can you hear my cat, babe? <laughs> no. Oh, do you want to meet her? Yeah, yeah. Come here, buddy. Come here. You want to say hello? This is kitty cat Nini. And you are a kitty cat, aren't you? <laughs> She's so cute. <laughs> She's so beautiful. Hi, Rainbow. Say hello. <laughs> She's like, let go of me. Oh, my goodness, babe. Babe, chill out. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Mama's. Oh, my God. <laughs> Y'all, that got crazy. We're back. <laughs> Sorry. She, Booby, why did you do that? She's looking at me like this. She's like. It's like, I hate you, mum. Um, okay, so you just you just have an energy of, like, you're just, like, I'm just here to, to like, do my thing, to be a really great gamer, and you guys can say whatever you want. Is that kind of how you feel about it? Yeah, I think so. Like, if, if, I, if I speak to it, uh, it's worse, you know? So I'm just, like, playing they can talk whatever they want so i just I, i'm just playing okay and so so it doesn't affect you wow that's like such a that's like a... uh when 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 it's like five games in, in a row uh sometimes i get really sad but i make like a pause and i go eat something and <laughs> sometimes i just play uh, the other day <laughs> The next day. What is their issue? Because you're a girl? Is that what their issue is? Uh, yeah, that I'm, uh, I'm like, uh, boosted. 
that is not my account that I paid someone to to rank me up. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, like, um, I think it's like um, difficult to see girls on a, ra um, a higher rank, you know? So it's like when I ranked up like plot, uh, I found a lot of men doing that. It's really complicated to see one girl on high rank. Yeah, wow. That is crazy. And at the end of the day, you just have to remember that they feel that way because you are like... Anyone boosting me and sense that you're so funny. Okay, um, you have to remember that like they're just jealous of you. Like that's just jealousy. That's just them being like annoyed that someone is so good you know what i mean yeah like um i play with my friends too mm -hmm. and sometimes they have to hear that and they're like i have to speak something and i just like ignore him <laughs> yeah because you don't want to make it worse right like i feel that way like yeah. like people sometimes people troll me on uh on tiktok and i'll respond and then they'll start arguing with me. Like sometimes it works. And sometimes when I call them out, they get embarrassed and then they stop. But most of the time they just say something else and I end up just getting hurt and offended. And I'm like, why did I not just ignore this? Like, Yeah, but uh, because most of the time they make that to uh, like you to give attention to them. It's so, it's so crazy to me. Sorry, I'm trying to get this to stop doing that. Um, it's so crazy to me, to me that like that's how you would go about getting attention is like just being mean. Like why would you want that attention? Because that's bad attention. Then they're like don't like mm -hmm. you. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. I hate that. Well, I'm so glad that you found a way to sort of like overcome that feeling and just like ignore it. I think it says a lot about – your uh mindset and the strength of of you basically that you can just like let it go because you know like i i have been acting for most of my life um i'm an actor primarily before before i was a voice actor i actually haven't been doing voice acting for that long and so it's so interesting right because like i've dealt with um rejection on a professional level so intensely because I, I was a model when I was younger and I'm an actor and I've just gone through a, a lot of rejection and I've had a lot of things said to me that were very hard to hear, you know, like things about my appearance and things about my abilities as an, as a, an actor or whatever. And even I, as someone who kind of feels like I'm very used to that level of criticism find that it becomes it can hurt my feelings and I've had many a conversations with Zaki actually about this where I will feel like it's too much for me and I will feel really overwhelmed and sad about it and I think that you know when you do get to that place a lot of times you really have to take a, a break and you have to say okay I'm not going to post online for a few days or a week whatever that time period may be but it's difficult yeah. when that is tied into you making money, which is what it is for you, you know? Yeah, I feel that. I really, I really understand that. Like sometimes we are weaker at that day, right? And, and like that, that type of, of thing can bring you down, you know? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Like sometimes you're just like, you're not able to just deal with it. Yeah. 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 I totally get that. Um, okay. So with that in mind, what advice would you give to any, any girl that's like looking to start playing games? Like, what would you, what would you say? I think I, I would say like the thing that I just said, like, uh, if you, if you want to be good, just play it. Don't, don't listen to the boys that are mean. And just play it. You're there to play it, to rank up, to get better. Just do it. Yes. Just keep going and just keep your, your head yeah. like f looking forward. Like, keep going forward. Yeah. 
Um, you like uh, watch for that girls on the game. They are really they're really badass. The boys play with with the, the girls on the game, so you can do it. Mm -hmm. You can you can do just the same. Yes, mm -hmm. I love that. There's also um, a server, an all girls uh, server on Discord called Gals Gal Ghouls Ghouls Ghouls. I always say it incorrectly. Ghouls. And it's a server for girl gamers. And I think if you're starting out, that might be a great place to go um, to connect with a community of girl gamers so that maybe if you want to have some friends. I always think that whether it's whether it's uh, of voice acting, gaming, whatever it might be, if you're looking to pursue something um, in the beginning, it's always good to like take a class or find a community of people that are interested in the same thing, like seek that out so that, you know, you can have friends that are doing the same thing or have the same interests as you. It's just really helpful. It's just a really good way to, to, to yeah. deal with it. You know, um, do you see more girls getting involved in gaming? Well, when when I started to play Valorant, I didn't knew any girls. It, I was I was trying to to make like a team, like a group of girls to play like five, as five. Okay. And I couldn't. But like um, one month ago, I I found a lot of girls playing Valorant, and they are good. They are uh, they they are high rank. Uh huh. And I'm enjoying I'm enjoying playing with. Uh, with that girls oh great do you feel like are they like at your level or are they like better than you or where are they at oh uh, some of them are better than me that's cool oh my god yeah. and are they in portugal as well oh i stopped listening you <laughs> oh that's okay uh, are they in, are they in portugal as well yeah yeah Oh, cool. Like, I know, like, six more girls that are, like, high rank. Mm hmm And we are playing together sometimes. Ooh. Damn. I love that. That's so cool. Um, oh, I, I think this is a really good question. Okay, what do you wish that you knew before you started streaming? Well... Uh, <laughs> a lot of stuff. Like I found, I found alone how to do stream. You know, I didn't ha have any help. Like um, maybe um, teaching myself how to use the the stream labs or something. <laughs> right. Like, do you wish that you had maybe like researched some stuff more in advance? A little bit. Yeah, I think so. I think so. Um, I always figure it out alone. So, <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, but I really liked it, like the 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 path, you know. Like I really liked it. So I don't know. I think I, I wouldn't change anything. Okay, I I like that. It's funny because you do kind of need to have things go wrong in order to learn. And yeah. I think I, I mean, I haven't been streaming for that long. I think I've been doing it for like three months now. And um, uh, P-I-W Duarte just followed. I say everyone's name wrong, but I think that's how you say it. So P-U Duarte, thank you so much for following. I appreciate you. Guys, if you're not already, follow along. Um, but yeah, I think that it's a really good way to learn like is just like making mistakes like you just you, you screw up and then you just like I don't know keep yeah. going you know it's like it's great yeah. I think it's really good to um to have that experience and to screw up sometimes yeah okay um what is the best way for fans to get in contact you uh, get in contact with you uh, maybe my Instagram or Twitter Okay. I think. Okay. Yeah. But like, I'm always streaming, so just like, come talk to me. <laughs> right, right. Just come and watch. Right, come and watch you yeah, stream. Yeah, because I stream in Portuguese, but I have a lot of people uh, English on my chat and Spanish, so I I talk in English a lot of times, like to respond to 
to everyone. Okay, okay. And um, do you have a Discord? Yeah, I have a Discord, like a uh, stream Discord. Um, yes, okay. Do, uh, sh so join the Discord. What is your dis Discord called? Oh, I, I don't know. It's like a link. <laughs> no, what do you call like your little group? Uh, my group is like the kittens. Ah, that's so cute! The kittens! Oh my god! <laughs> my group are called the babes. Brenda's babes. <laughs> <laughs> that's so cute as well. <laughs> yeah, head on over to uh, Kitty Cat Nini's uh, Twitch and in her about section you can find the information to her discord so that you can join her server and guys if you want to join my discord server um, the link is uh, in chat right now and you can should I share his discord yeah you can share uh, uh, kitty cat Nini's discord you can also uh, my discord was just in chat too also huge shout out to Zaki who just joined um, very late but you'll have to watch Everything that happened before this, Zaki, um, we've been we've been really chatting. It's been such a fun interview. Um, okay, let's have a look. I just want to make sure that I've asked you all of the questions that I wrote down. Oh, what do you hope for the future of Valorant? Like, what do you want to see? Like, any agents that you hope that they get? Like, what what's what's that like for you? I'm I'm really excited to see more sentinels. That is like the um, the the type of agents that I play, like Killjoy and Sage. And mm -hmm. I I'm I really want to play another sentinel. Okay, okay. And in terms of like lore and like we have this new map coming out, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and what what do you think is going to be like what do you what do you like feel like could could be coming for us? I don't know. I don't know. I I think we have to wait. <laughs> Did you sign an NDA? Maybe. <laughs> I'm sorry. I didn't know that you actually knew shit. <laughs> I didn't know. <laughs> I totally get it. I've signed so many NDAs. Don't I, worry about I didn't it. Say, I didn't say anything. I know. It's totally fine. I, I, I completely forgot that they probably told you stuff. Um, I, I have signed NDAs too, but I actually don't know anything about the new maps coming out. Um, so I don't know anything about that, so, like, whatever to me. But, like, I forgot that you probably do because you're Killjoy's ambassador. But I know what it's like to have, like, signed an NDA, and it's the most awkward thing. I was going to do a podcast yesterday and, like, uh, sorry, I was going to do a podcast today and, like, I need to get questions sent to me in advance because I need to know what people are going to ask me because I have signed NDAs. Like, you can't just go and talk about anything. So, um, yeah, it's so funny. Hang on. My best friend just texted me and said, are you streaming? So I'm just going to respond to her <laughs> and tell her that I am. Okay. Okay. Um, all right. So that's a great answer. I totally get it. We're excited to see what's going to come out. It's going to be so fun. I think we've got some really exciting stuff ahead. From a voice acting perspective, I'm just hoping that we can get some new voice lines, some more fun stuff coming out. So that's really cool, something to look forward to. Um, you, can, you can tell us if you're like recording some more voice lines. I don't know if I can tell you or not. So mm, okay. <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> So well, I I hope I love to like when the patches come out and uh, there's like new voice lines. I I'm the first person to notice that. I oh, really like okay. Well, tell me, tell me. You have to tell me what you like. Like if you hear any new voice lines, you have to tell me. I, which I stopped ones you listening like. you again. Oh, okay. Um, you have you have to tell me if you like any. Like if you hear any okay. and you really like them, like let me know which okay. ones you like. If, if my, anyone. My, knew my favorite one right now about Sky is like the Yoru one. It's like a uh, flower girl. I have some leaves. Do you want them? Oh, 
Um, and what uh, can you respond with that? She goes, hang on, let me think of it. Um, <laughs> something, something. And then she says, but if you call me a flower girl again, I'll break your nose. Is it that one? <laughs> Wait, what is she? Yeah, what yeah, is she? It is. Hang on. I think, it, I, think I, don't, I don't need it. I have uh, so many already. But if you call me a flower girl. Oh, again. yes. Yeah, she says, um. No thanks, I've got enough. But if you call me a flower girl again, I'll break your nose. Do you know? <laughs> do you know that was in funniest. the that was in the audition? That was in the audition I did. That's the funniest one. Yeah. I love that. <laughs> <laughs> she's uh, she's she's she gets really annoyed. I feel like her and Yuru are like so like opposite personalities that I can see them like really not getting along. You know. <laughs> Yeah, I really like that one that is like, good on ya, you know, I really like that. Oh, okay, yes, good on ya, good on ya. Yeah. Um, yeah. Is there anything that, uh, I don't know how long, hang on, let me just check my Twitch and see how long we have, how long we've been talking for. Um, is there anything that you want me to say for you, any questions that you want to ask me as we kind of wrap everything up today? Is there anything you want to know? Do I don't you? know. Uh, I'm really nervous, like, right? <laughs> you, you've <laughs> done so like well. Like <laughs> no, you've done... I am so impressed by you. I just think you're the best. Um, you have done so well. I'm going to move you for a second. Don't get annoyed at me, guys. Oh, my goodness, no. Okay, wait, hang on. I know, I know I'm moving her. I'm just seeing how long we've been going. We've been live for it. Um. Uh, you know what to do. You know what to ask, please. Guys, well, if you have anything in chat that you want to <laughs> ask, um, just let me, just let me know and I can uh, answer it or whatever. Um, someone asked me in my Discord server, uh, oh, X-Pony said Nini has something to ask. Nini, what? What they is it? They are so bad to me. They are so bad to me. <laughs> are they teasing you? <laughs> like, um... Uh, Sensei Bolinga is my mod, and uh, Exponi is like the top donator of my channel. And uh, like we have um, a meme that is like I I always scream with the people. Like, <laughs> what is it? Like I I'm always screaming with my mods. Like they are not doing a good job, you know. But it's like <laughs> it's like a joke. <laughs> Okay, but what do you say? <laughs> like, uh, I have a joke that I I keep my mods on my basement. And I don't give any food to them. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> is it, is it, I think that someone just said it and it got blocked in chat. <laughs> so, yeah. we, okay, we, yeah. won't, we won't say that because I upload this to YouTube. Yeah, we won't say that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we won't say that. It's like a meme. It's like a joke. It's not like, but they they are really they they wanted me to ask you to mm. say it to put like an alert on my on my yeah, on my stream. No, y'all. No. <laughs> oh my god! I can't even imagine where that would end up on the internet if I did say that. So I can't. I can't. Do that. I told you guys. <laughs> no, I can't, you guys. But God bless you. And I mean, <laughs> you guys are funny. You guys are funny. No, I'm not gonna say it. They, they are the worst. <laughs> Yo, I'm I'm an actor. I, I have a professional career to keep. This isn't my only fans. I, I told them that you couldn't say it. <laughs> they are so. You guys are so cheeky. You're so cheeky. Um, well, I I, <laughs> I really enjoyed talking to you, um, Nini. You are awesome. You have such a beautiful energy. And I think that, um, yeah, I'm really excited to see where your career goes and what lies ahead for you in gaming. Um, and you have, to, you have to stay in contact with us and we have to do future things. We have to collab together. <laughs> You're just not responding anymore. <laughs> You're just like... Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. 
<laughs> yeah, like please, yeah. I really, I really like to to talk with you. And I'm serious. Um, I think you're an amazing person. Thank you so much for inviting me. And I hope I can still talk with you and make some funny stuff. And yeah. Yes, of course. And girl, I want you to start this TikTok. Um, yeah, I will start it. <laughs> I promise. <laughs> You have made me laugh so much. You guys are so friggin' cute. Guys, uh, join Nini's Discord. Follow Nini on Twitch. Follow me on Twitch. Follow me on TikTok. Oh my god, just follow everything. Join my Discord server. Um, guys, this has been so fun. I just love talking to you guys. Oh, also, uh, Simply Santasia just reminded me that someone asked me a question in my Discord. And then I got distracted by the chat. Um, so, so someone, and I apologize that I'm not saying your name, but someone asked me about the Sky playlist that they put on Spotify. And um, basically, they asked me if I had any input in it, and I didn't have any input in it. Um, but then they sent it to me. And I, w I thought it was really cool that there was a playlist for my character. So when I was, I, I run outside a lot. And when I would go for runs, I would listen to the Sky song and I would be like, oh yeah. Um, I really like the Killjoy one. Oh, I'll have to listen to it. I love that they make play playlists for the characters. I think that's like yeah. so iconic. Like it's such a smart idea. Like I just seriously, I think they create the world so well. Um, yes, so... Hiro Hirokosa said, did you do the voice acting of Zephyr? Yes, I'm the voice of Zephyr in XCOM Chimera Squad. If you'll play her, let me know. I'm obviously the voice of Sky in the video game Valorant. We have the Killjoy ambassador in Portugal, Kitty Cat Nini. Um, sh follow her on Twitch. She is a legend. I have loved talking to her today, guys. We are going to head on out. Thank you so much, Nini, for being with us. Um, Thank you for inviting me. Of course, of course. Um, also, before I go, as always, huge thank you to my moderator, Simply Santasia, for all her love and support and kindness. Um, I really love you. Shout out to Lessie. I love you as well, Lessie. Shout out to Zaki for connecting us. Um, you guys are all amazing. Uh, Simply Santasia, is Zaki live? Is anyone live right now? Who do we want to... Do we want to, who do we want to raid? Is Carolina live? No, she's, she's live on Tuesdays and Thursdays. Whatever. I will leave this up to, uh, to my girl, Simply Santasia. She knows what she's doing. Raid whoever you want. I love you guys. Thank you so much for your love and support. We will talk to you soon. Bye. You. <laughs> Hang on. I got to move it.